Hey everyone, welcome back or welcome to my channel. It's been a while, I know it has. By the time this video comes up, I don't know how long it will have been, but I have a little bit of a life update. And as the title of the video suggests, we're giving this whole room a bit of a makeover. Um, it probably looks fine from what you can see here, but it is in complete disarray. Things have just been sitting around, building up different projects that I don't know where to put. I have a lot of things that are currently on the go. Really, it's just, I have too much stuff. I'm kind of a hoarder, so oops. But anyways, before I get into all of that, I just wanted to share with you a quick life update. Um, long story short, um, I just got engaged <laughs> about a week ago from when I'm filming this. Not even a week ago, like a few days ago. Um, so yeah, I was on a little bit of a vacation this last week. That's what my boyfriend wanted to do for his birthday. His fiance now, how fancy. Um, so then we extended the trip a little bit and went down just to go see my family as well. And on this vacation, he proposed. So yeah, super exciting, it was very cute. I will share some details of that later. I just wanna share the news. Um, while I was down on vacation, also got a new tattoo. It's a shark jaw on my elbow. As you can see, there's still like the ticket arm plastic on it. Um, I've been really bad about sharing my art probably since I graduated university a year ago. Like I have projects that I've done, I've completed them, and I have some clips of me, like that I've, the process that I've filmed, I just haven't shared them. So at some point I'll have to get through the backlog of that footage and do that. And I will, you know, try and reorganize and do this room without spoiling too much of that kind of stuff. Um, but that's why I'm pointing out that new tattoo now. Probably didn't share that one either. This one, I don't think there's been any pictures, but I've had that one since September. So anyways, I think I've been rambling. My brain really is not working too well right now. It's so hot. I hate the heat. I'm gonna turn the fan on. I just wanted to like not have the noise of the fan while I was sitting here chatting with you. But anyways, that's the life update. I'm engaged now and I'm now up to 11 tattoos. So that's cool. Let's get on. <laughs> Let's get on to organizing this room. I will show you a quick spin around first just to see what we're working with here. Okay, so this is the desk that we all know and love. Why my drawers are open over here, I don't know. I do have a chair in the corner. It's covered in shit, things. Oh my God. Okay, so first of all, I have to clean the desk. And then we get into the disaster zone, number one. Don't even want to look at the garbage there, but there's just stuff piled, like literally piled in, there's no floor space over here at all. My wreath that I made for the door broke because it was so cold, so I have to fix that. And then we've got all this stuff over here. Surprises on the table here that I don't really want you to see yet. Oh God, it's blocked my knee on the table. My wall of art is nice and intact, but yeah, so that's the room tour. Let's get to fixing it. Voice over Kyra here. So these first few time-lapse clips are just me putting together some Ikea stuff. I bought some different organizational pieces to kind of help make the room feel a little bit more organized and help me categorize my stuff and make it more conducive to actually doing art. I built this little shelf thing. You see me fiddle with it for so long because I put it together wrong the first time and didn't realize until I had like hammered everything into place with my fists. Also, so sorry you have to see my feet. Usually don't put them out there for free, but it was hot. What can I say? I filmed, like I got engaged on like June 7th and it's now the middle of July. So I'm, I'm so sorry that I've been so absent from online and responding to people and posting things. And I appreciate every single one of you that has chosen to stick by me and wait for new videos to come out. I, in my absence of posting and whatnot, I did see this thing about executive dysfunction and I'm not one that condones self-diagnoses and I, I'm not in any way, shape or form diagnosing myself with anything. But what the person was talking about in the video related to relating to executive dysfunction really kind of resonated with me. Long story short, it's where you can be very productive and effective at your job that you do. And then as soon as you get home and it comes to like chores or your hobbies, you just can't do it no matter how hard or how much you want to do the thing. So yeah, if that has ever happened to you, let me know. You are not alone and it's very frustrating to deal with and it feels very disappointing, but yeah. So here's the same desk that was at the beginning. Took a little break to have dinner, but I've added my stuff to the wall here. I cleaned all the stuff off of here, organized some books that 
chair over there is still a mess, but we're working on it. This is way better. I just need, to, those are all Christmas ornaments that don't have a home yet. I think I'm gonna add them into the bin of DIY Christmas ornaments. I've reorganized our shelf here. And then I've added all this stuff to the top of this shelf. So now it's like mostly clean. Mm, that's all from the Ikea, but like this is a great improvement. As I promised, here are the more satisfying clips of me actually cleaning things. I cannot believe that this pile of recycle was just like in the closet for the longest time ever. I don't know how I live like this sometimes. I think once you're so busy and so overwhelmed with everything, you kind of just get used to a certain level of, I don't want to say filth because like just having a box of recycle that's relatively contain contained is like not filthy, but you know what I mean. You just get used to a certain level of it when you don't have the energy to get rid of it. But now the art room is cleaner. It has stayed cleaner now that it's, you know, a month and a half after I filmed this. So I'm proud of myself. And here is the finished room. Um, still a bit of a mess in some places, but overall significantly better than it was. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, comment down below, subscribe to my channel. I post new videos on Monday, sometimes Wednesdays. I hope you have a lovely week and I will see you all in the next video. Thank you.